Sup guys, my name is Justin and I am joined with Nate. Sup guys. We are so happy that you guys have been enjoying our new little mini series, Black Series Bangers. But not every figure in the line is a banger. There have been some terrible, terrible Black Series blunders. So welcome to the sister series of Black Series Bangers. Today we're going to be talking about why... <sighs> Prepare yourself. General... Grievous is a Black Series blunder. No, 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 no. Now hear us <laughs> out. I can hear you typing. Stop typing. Hear us out. General Grievous is the first deluxe figure, Nate. Yeah, and at the time we were like, you know, hey, this is pretty cool. Not right. bad. But then he came out, and I just want to get this right out of the gate. He can't stand. Yep. I yep. understand that some of you will comment saying, my Grievous stands no problem. But we have been in the Black Series community for like seven, eight years now. And it's a pretty common thing that people say. Everyone says that their Grievous can't stand. Yep. Some people's copies are better than others, but mm -hmm. right out of the gate, this figure cannot stand. You have a slightly better chance without the cape on, but if you mm -hmm. put that cape on, absolutely not because yeah. it adds so much weight to the back of the figure that it just he mm. wants to tip the feet it's like those dog foot joints and yeah. it's so loose i mean what good is a figure if it can't stand right as you guys can see i literally have to have mine on this stand 24 7 otherwise it will fall over and all of these lightsabers will take several <laughs> other figures with him yes so he's forever been banished to a stand but mm -hmm. not only is he too short and just generally underscaled because oh, yeah. you know general grievous is a big hulking character he's hunched over 99 percent of the time we see him yeah even in like shots from revenge of the sith he's taller than the b1 battle droid when he's hunched over right and this figure <laughs> is literally as tall as a B1 battle droid, so, yeah. or, or maybe slightly taller. Yeah, I have some comparison shots from our Discord, join that Discord, of some, you know, just standing next to the B1 battle droid, and uh, there was one image where he was standing next to the Bandai model kit, and this is yes. just such a fantastic example. Both of these are 112 scale items. General Grievous, he needs a bit more bulk, and he needs to be taller. He needs to tower over Obi-Wan, B1 battle droids, whatever. Yep. The other complaint that I have about this figure as well is, like you mentioned, it was the very first deluxe figure. And they didn't put Grievous's logo on his cape. It's right on the cape. And yeah. it's very visible. So for them to just gloss over that detail. Yeah, even back then with deluxe figures, they were missing detail. So this isn't like some brand new thing. Like these deluxe figures have always been, I mean, D1, yep. we're missing detail. Yeah. Cause I've seen some rhetoric online where it's like deluxe figures used to be this. Mm -hmm. They used to be knocking it out of the park. And I'm like, well, I mean, look at the very first D1 here. He's missing detail. It's a fine sculpt. I yeah. like the sculpt and the sculpted details, yeah. but he is missing a little bit of detail on that cape you know with the logo like you said and the final reason why this is a black series blunder is the character general grievous is iconic mm -hmm. he is a prominent villain in the prequel era he's super popular and you see him everywhere he's in like every other clone wars episode mm -hmm. you know six seven seasons of clone wars and it's just like also endless memes yeah he he's just so important mm -hmm. that when you finally get a character that you really really hope they knock it out of the park and then they don't it stings more mm -hmm. than when a black series figure comes out and it's eh but it's like not really that important of a character right so the prominence of the character also adds to this being such a blunder because it just stings more when it's a super iconic villain that you want a fantastic figure for, and now I gotta track down the Bandai model kit. And that is why General Grievous is a Black Series blunder. Yes, let us know. I'm sure people will disagree because we put him on our worst Black Series <laughs> list. Even someone recently commented on our best of, where's General Grievous? Well, guess what, bucko? There Here were, he is. There were a few comments from the top 10 of all time. Yeah. The 2023 edition, just a few weeks ago. Check that video out. Asking, where's General Grievous? Are you kidding me? 
He's a Black Series blunder, and you've been filled in by Out of the Basement. Let us know what you guys think in the comments down below. Leave a like. Subscribe if you're new. We are always talking about Black Series here on the channel. Join that channel membership for 99 cents a month. Link in the description. I've been Justin, joined with Nate. See you guys later. And we will see you guys in the next video.